Ms. Gordon. Um, thank you very much for letting me speak. As a public health advocate, advocator, I wanted the city council to know that President Biden has proclaimed December 2022 as Nationally Impaired Driving Prevention Month. The president urged all Americans to make responsible decisions and take appropriate measures to prevent impaired driving. During the holiday season, many of us look forward to getting together with friends and family. Unfortunately, holidays can be a dangerous time for alcohol and drug-related traffic incidents, especially with our young people. Over 10,000 Americans' lives are lost to drunk and impaired, drug-impaired driving each year accounting for nearly one-third of all traffic deaths. In 2019, some 11 percent of Americans drove under the influence, including a staggering 19.6 um, percent of people ages 21 through 25. Far too many families are left with their world changed forever. Far, far too many passengers and pedestrians see their lives destroyed by someone else's bad decision. We all need to work towards reducing substance abuse disorder, raising awareness of the dangers of impaired driving, and investing in technology that could prevent crashes, injuries, and death. I urge the City Council to look for policies that will reduce substance abuse and raise awareness within our community on the dangers of impaired driving. Thank you.